Hello, today I'm going to walk you through the process of creating your own pixel control app. Enjoy. Hello, today I'm going to walk you through the process of making your own pixel controlled hat. Before in front of you, you will see a series of items that you will need. First up, we have a glue gun, we have some foam, we have some wire, razor, wire stripper, screwdriver, ESP art stick costume edition, electrical tape, and some extra wire. Now, we will be using pixels known as the WS2812. These are a flex matrix panels that you can get on Amazon. They come in a 16 by 16, an 8 by 32, and also have some other sizes that you can work with. Here we have two of them placed together, two 8x32s put together so that we have a nice wide angled set of pixels. But you can also do smaller. The first thing we want to do is remove the existing wires. That way we can solder on our own wires. You can create your costume in different types such as in 16x16 or in this case we're going to do an 8x32. So first place the two 8x32s together. Measuring out the wire, cut your wire, then strip the wire, and then solder them together. Next, make sure they're lined up nicely and use your electrical tape to tape them together. Next, use some wider electrical tape, this to ensure that the matrices stay close together and do not move. If you have a 3D printer, the link below provides you a slide hinge. This can be used as a connector for your design. After you have your two panels together, lay them out and mark it with your foam. Your foam is going to be your back end and also the support for your matrix onto your hat. This serves two purposes. One, to give more stability for your matrix as you curve it around your hat. And two, also gives the spacing that you need. Sometimes matrices on the hat will overlap. So choose the foam that you want accordingly to make sure that it fits your hat correctly. This is where you use your hot glue gun. The hot glue gun allows you to glue the foam onto your matrix. You can also use 3M double sided tape but what I found is that the hot glue makes it a lot more lasting bond. Make sure to solder on your longer wire. That is the connection between the ESP art stick and of course your pixels. Once that is done you can proceed with gluing together the foam to your matrix. Once that is done, you can place your matrix onto your hat. Mark a small hole where the wire would go into the hat. This would be used for your ESP art stick and for your battery.